Hello and welcome back. The last part of the solution of an assignment problem covering the flight management in an airline company or pairing of flights. The last stage. We have already converted the original problem or managerial problem into an assignment problem. Now solving the assignment problem by HAM, Hungarian assignment method. For this purpose we have to prepare first a reduced table that will be reduced table 1 and the rule for preparing the first reduced table is row minus lowest time. From each and every row we are going to subtract the lowest time. In the first row the lowest time is 6. 20 minus 6 is 14. 19 minus 6 is 13. 6 minus 6 is 0. 9 minus 6 is 3. <coughs> Row 2, lowest time is 9, we are going to subtract 9 from all the values. 22 minus 9, 13. 21 minus 9, 12. 6 minus 9, 7 and 9 minus 9, 0. Third row, the lowest time is 16 and we are going to subtract 16 from all these four values. 16 minus 16, 0. 17 minus 16, 1. 22 minus 16, 6. 17 minus 16, 1. And the last row, the lowest time is 9, we are going to subtract 9 from all the values, 10 minus 9, 1, 9 minus 9, 0, 16 minus 9, 7, 21 minus 9, 12. Now, after subtracting the lowest value from each and every row, check whether there is at least one zero in each and every column. First column yes, second column yes, third column yes, fourth column yes. That means now we have at least one zero in each row and each column. That means we can go for trial of assignments. And to make assignments, we always go from row to column, from top to bottom. First we are going to select the row with originally one zero only, single zero. And we will start from top and we will go to bottom. First row, single zero, yes it qualifies. Let us select this zero for assignment. And check whether is there any other zero in the same column. If yes, cancel them. There is no other zero. So now check the second row. Second row has only one zero originally. So it also qualifies. Assignment. Is there any other zero in the same column? No. If there is, cancel them. Now it is time to check third row. Third row has only one zero. So it is also eligible for assignment. Now check whether any other zero in the same column. No. If there, cancel them. Now we are going to check the fourth row. It is also with single zero originally. So we can treat it as eligible for assignment and is there any other zero in the same column no if yes cancel them now check if all the rows and columns are with only one assignment row 1 yes row 2 yes row 3 yes row 4 yes column 1 yes column 2 yes column 3 yes column 4 yes that means this is the optimal solution to this problem so we have to prepare the optimal pairing of flights. Yes, okay. Now flight number. Will become flight number. And over time yes over time uh, yes screw base that okay what is going to happen first of all ak1 ak2 ak3 ak4 now AK1 will become KA3. The layover time will be 6 hours. 
इट इज बेस्ड एट अहमदाबाद दैट वी कैन सी इन द प्रीवियस टू टेबल्स हैविंग ले ओवर टाइम और ले ओवर मेट्रिक्स वन ले ओवर मेट्रिक्स टू फ्रॉम विच वी कैन राइट दिस कमेंट सो बी केयरफुल चेक दिस पॉइंट इन योर सोल्यूशन इन योर नोटबुक नाउ ए के टू बिकम्स के ए फोर द मिनिमम ले ओवर टाइम इज नाइन आवर्स एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू प्रीवियस टेबल्स इट इज ऑल्सो बेस्ड ऑन अहमदाबाद How can we write this comment? Check six selected from first table based at Ahmedabad or first uh, second table based at Kolkata. It is from the first table. Similarly, nine was also selected from the first table based at Ahmedabad. Now AK three becomes KA one. In case of equal layover time, you can write name of any city. Yes, it is sixteen. And first table, Ahmedabad. AK four becomes KA two. And layover time is nine hours. And that was from the second table. That means crew based at Kolkata. Yes. So this is. the assignment or rather say optimal pairing of flights and minimum time 25 plus 15 40 so this is the optimal solution to the original managerial problem that was the problem of flight management in an airline company operating four flights between amdavad and kolkata yes so before say treating this as an assignment problem we have to go through a specific process of preparing layover matrix assuming the crew based at one center and assuming crew based at another center then from these two layover matrix we select the minimum time and prepare this layover matrix having minimum layover time and treating this as an assignment problem we can solve it through hsam that's it thank you very much